Hey guys, this is Rob from Classic Car Living. Today we're headed over to Ford of Kendall in Miami for the Back to Blue event. It's a cruise in to the Ford dealership. You're gonna have some classic cars, some modern cars, some DJ, some music, and some free food. So let's go check it out. All right, so which one of these would you want? modern Mach 1 or the Mach 1 Tribute 1970. You know which one I'm going to pick. That 1970 is mine, but this is Lucas's Mach 1. We had a great turnout here at Ford of Kendall. A lot of cars for a good cause. Check out this Chevelle SS. Guys, if you like my videos, please subscribe and share. This is going to help me out so I can keep going with the channel. It's a beautiful night. Great weather and great cars. Look at this interior. Now we got this beautiful Fox body with the racing kit. Saw that turbo. What do you guys think of this car? Let me know in the comments, please. Leave comments, let me know what you guys wanna see and if you guys like these type of cars. Look at this, wow. Here's another Fox body. It's a Mustang GT with a sunroof. Nice stance, look at that. Let's listen to this. For those who follow my channel, you guys know this car. This is Tony's 68 GT 500 Tribute. If you haven't seen this video, go to my channel and check it out. It is amazing. This car is absolutely gorgeous and it flies. Check out this 1972 Buick Centurion convertible. Look at the size of this car. It has 44,000 original miles. It is owned by a good friend of mine named Bob Mayer. He's selling this beautiful car if anybody is interested. I think he's asking $35,000. There's the window sticker on it. Here it is. Here's the information. Now we have his 1959 Ford Fairlane 500 Skyliner. Look at this convertible. Have you seen anything like this? This version was only produced for three months. So this is a very rare car. 
in mint condition. Check out the window sticker. I'm looking to do a video with Bob so we can check out these cars. Look at the way that it closes. Nineteen sixty six Ford Mustang GT convertible. Now we have this Fox body. Looks like a state trooper fan. It might have been in one of the state trooper vehicles, actually. Check out this duster, rare duster, 340. Look at this engine bay. I've shown this in other car shows. I finally met the owner. I told the owner to send me an email so I could highlight this car, get a little story about it and get the history. So I'm waiting on that, but check this thing out. It is absolutely gorgeous. It looks like it came out of the factory. This is a very rare duster also. This trunk looks mint condition. I love those tail lights. Take a look at this interior. That is absolutely gorgeous. Now let's check out this Cobra convertible. I haven't seen this car around yet. Guys, let me know what you want to see. Put in the comments the type of cars you want to see. If you guys have any information on these cars, let me know. Also, subscribe. It helps me out with the algorithm. Comment, share. All of that stuff helps me out so I can keep going. Here's another Cobra. We're going to have two Cobras, as you can see. If you go to my channel, I did a whole video on the Cobra Club of South Florida. Great guys, great cars and these things fly. I also did an interview with uh, my dentist who has one of these Cobras and the thing flies. So if you wanna see an interesting story, go to my channel and check it out. Look at this Cobra. I love this one. The color combination on this thing is awesome. I love that engine compartment too. This is a 1979 Mustang GT pace car. Obviously that is not the original engine, but this thing is a monster and a beast. So we're here at Ford of Kendall. Let's go inside and I'm gonna show you the surprise that I wanted to show you guys. Tell me, oh, wrong door. All right, so you guys tell me which one of these three Hertz would you wanna pick? I will take this one, thank you very much. This 1966 GT350 Hertz Fastback is 
absolutely gorgeous. I'm not saying the other ones don't look bad, but you know me, I am a classic guy all the way. Look at this thing, this is beautiful. Yes, it's a real Shelby. Saw the bumper sticker, look at all these. Very nice, but I'm sorry. This first one is my take. Look at all three of these, they're gorgeous, but the first one is my pick. This event was held at the Fort of Kendall in South Florida, and uh, they did this for a good cause, backing the blue. Check out this 1969 GT500 Shelby, mint condition. Fort of Kendall held this event for back the blue, to back the Hispanic, Police Officers Association. Now this 1963 and a half Ford Galaxy 500 XL Sport Coupe with a rare 427 R code four speed. This thing is pretty cool and the paint job and everything on this car is immaculate. This is concourse at its finest. Check out those rims. Nice interior. I just love these rims. Now check out this Ford GT. Ford of Kendall, as you can see, was packed. We had a lot of cars, great turnout for a great cause. And it wasn't just Fords. We had a bunch of different cars, as you'll see. And this is the vintage Metro Dade Police Department car. Back in the 80s and 90s, this is the cars that they used. And the PBA is actually uh, takes us to car shows and it's in great condition, brings back good memories or some bad memories actually, just kidding. Here's another Ford GT, but check out this engine compartment. Look at the size of that tire, what? Uh, I'd like a ride please, thank you. Who else would want a ride in this thing? So this is my buddy Alex's new Pantera. I've been trying to convince him to do a story with me on this car and his garage. He's got a bunch of cars, but he's a little shy. There he is there with his drink, but I'll convince him. Maybe leave some comments to convince him, guys. I wanna check out his garage and his uh, car collection. And this is his other buddy, Alex. And he told me he wants to do a story on this pickup truck in uh, really, really nice condition. All right, so everyone's leaving. It was a great turnout. Back to blue. Thank you, Ford of Kendall. We'll see you next time.